Tip. Today I'm back with another recipe for you. I'm really excited to share this one with you. This is a health tonic in apple cider vinegar that's going to help you with weight loss and also with detoxing or cleansing your body out. It's super delicious. It's easy just to pop in a mason jar and take on the go. And you're going to get a really nice internal flush. And it's also going to give you a little pick me up, a little boost in energy as well. So if you're interested in seeing this recipe that I made here, it tastes really great as well, then keep watching. So first things first, I'm using a mason jar here. And I really love mason jars because they have the measurements right here on the side. So I'm gonna fill it up with two cups of water. For the water, I'm just going to be using my Brita filter. I am going to take the raw apple cider vinegar, and this is the Bragg's brand. This one's organic, and this one has the mother. So you want to look for the um, apple cider vinegar that kind of has this cloudiness. You can see right here, kind of gathering on the bottom. It's only three calories per tablespoon as well. For that, I will be using a tablespoon. Shake it up really good. Shake this up, because it's unfiltered, so you want to get everything. And for every cup of water, you can add one to two tablespoons, depending on your, your liking. Some people can't handle that much. So for me, I will do two tablespoons, a tablespoon per cup of water. Remember, it is vinegar, so the flavor is going to be a little stinky. But few ingredients we'll be adding are going to aid in masking that flavor. Next, we are going to be taking our honey. This one here is a raw local honey from the valley where I live. I live in Fresno, so this one is raw. Um, it says it's raw. My father-in-law actually gave it to me. I'm used to the raw honeys being very cloudy, so this one's a little off, but it's all I have right now until I'm able to go pick up a new one. So I'm going to be using this. Um, cloudy is generally the key to knowing that you're using a raw honey and it's almost like a really thick pasty kind of texture. But here I'm using this honey. Raw honey is really good for you. The best raw honeys are going to be the Manuka honey, but it's kind of expensive, so any raw honey will do. Now, what's really great about honey is it has antibacterial properties, so it's a natural infection fighter and a rapid healer. Honey is also a powerful antioxidant and aids with digestion and immunity. The honey also helps soothe a sore throat, so since we're putting some highly acidic ingredients in our drink, this honey is going to help balance out that little throat hit that you get. I'll be using a small bowl for this. This is actually a mocajete, and as you can hear, I'm running the water. So what I'm going to do is take a tablespoon of my honey and drop it in this bowl. And what I'm going to do is add a little bit of hot water to help kind of, uh, or warm water, to help liquefy this because we want it to blend well into our drink. Now I'm going to add it to my drink. Make sure it's not too warm. We don't want to cook the honey and get rid of all those natural things that are so beneficial to having raw honey. Our next ingredient, cinnamon, is really important for your body as well because not only does it boost your metabolism, but it also helps control your blood sugar and uh, decrease insulin levels and also can even fight off candida yeast infection. So not just for women yeast infections, but candida is yeast that's just located throughout your whole body and you can even have an overgrowth of yeast on your tongue. It's pretty much everywhere. So the cinnamon really helps fight that off as well. Now what I'm going to do here is add a couple dashes of cinnamon. And as you can see, it kind of floats on the top. If you've watched the cinnamon challenge, you know how that goes. If you can't get it to mix very well right now, it's okay because it's in a mason jar, so we can always shake it later. So the next thing we're going to be adding is a cayenne pepper. This one here says red pepper, but underneath you can see it's cayenne. I purchased this one from Trader Joe's. Now what this is going to do is it's going to really boost our metabolism. And because we added that cinnamon already, this is just going to kind of build the heat of the cinnamon. It's not going to taste salty or anything like that because this is pure cayenne pepper. So it's just going to kind of make it taste like a really spicy cinnamon. I'm just slightly mixing now because like I said, we're going to add, or we're going to shake it up in our jar later. 
Our next ingredient, you're going to want to take a lemon. I already have one I already cut here. It's okay if you get the seeds in there. Now I'm going to squeeze in half a small lemon. It's juice. There we go. So, a lot of our dry ingredients are um, floating and sticking to the top. So what we're going to do is shake, shake, shake with the mason jar. I'm just going to put my lid on, two-part lid, and just shake. Okay guys, so my last and final suggestion would be picking up one of these stainless steel straws. You can get these on Amazon. This is really good because this is pretty acidic. You don't want to ruin your enamel of your teeth because you're trying to balance out the rest of our body. So by picking up a straw, um, whether it's a glass or a stainless steel or metal straw, it's just going to help balance that out. All right, guys, try this out. Let me know how you like it. If you end up using it, take a picture and upload it on Instagram and tag me in it. I'd love to see you guys trying it out, maybe different variances of the recipe. So if you're not following me on Instagram, it is Tiffany Espinoza.